Northwest Technical College in Bemidji has spent the past 12 months getting their new commercial refrigeration degree program ready for students. Reporter Sherelle Moore has a look at what the career field has to offer. I foresee our commercial refrigeration as being at the top of the list. There is such a demand currently for that level of a technician. Um, I think our placement's going to be high, I, close to 100% if someone wants employment. When you think of in-demand career fields with a very high earning potential, commercial refrigeration might be one that slips your mind. But the industry is growing and in need of some good workers. Commercial refrigeration um, is a profession that is, is unique and different than regular heating and ventilation. And the reason for that is, is it's, it's, it's more focused on facilities such as grocery stores, convenience stores, produce storage areas, and with each of those items, their temperatures must be specific. For a while now, Industry leaders have asked Northwest Technical College for a degree program like this one. We're excited because um, we received a grant and we've got some matching dollars to go with that grant. And so thanks to the Nielsen Foundation for that grant. But we will have uh, about $300,000 worth of new equipment that will be coming into the program uh, to help our students make sure that they're really learning on the equipment that they'll see out in the field that is currently out in business and industry. The program will only take two years, and when you graduate, you'll have a universal license in handling refrigerants and working on the technical side of the career field. Because of its uniqueness, we felt it was imperative to have it independent. Unlike our other program, our plumbing and heating program that are combined, the commercial refrigeration program is really kind of a standalone. For anyone interested, there's still a few weeks to sign up. But you should get the paperwork done quickly because that time will fly by. And there's plenty of time to enroll yet in the next three weeks for fall starts. And we still even have some scholarship dollars that are available for folks as they come along. Reporting in Bemidji, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. The college is still currently seeking faculty members to teach in the program. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.